Hi, this is David with entry number 702. I'm here near uh, Sargon University, which is a very large uh, Jesuit university here in uh, Korea. It's actually this, this way. Um, it's actually a very beautiful, very small campus that um, yeah, that has all these English-named buildings. So it's a very anachronistic, um, or at least it feels that way when you're walking around the campus. Um, it is very cold again. The temperatures drop probably about 12 degrees uh, Fahrenheit, and therefore is uncomfortable. Um, this is an interesting thing the camera's doing. It's completely blowing out right here. It's actually kind of cool. Looks like snow. Anyway, I wanted to uh, talk about a couple things. And uh, one thing I've noticed uh, about these entries is that I think they're going to be, since I'm doing them every day, until I have an ability to shoot video on a nice camera again. You know, frankly, I could do it now, but it's kind of not worth the hassle. Um, I am going to keep these entries a bit short. Um, maybe not super short, because I know the last couple, the last few have been relatively long, but, uh, you know, I don't know, I just feel like that's one thing I'll maybe try and do. I've just come back from checking out a few more academies, two of which seemed okay, which I, will, I guess I'll pursue. Um, so that's uh, good, I guess. Um, we both work with, uh, specialize in uh, writing, English writing, which I think is good. Like. Um, college application essays and stuff like that. Um, it's a little weird on I mean, the outside of the buildings. Kind of was touted that the uh, the head teachers there had all gone to like Ivy League American universities, which is always weird. It it, it is weird. I think that a lot of these like kids here. You know, they want to go to the best, like, uh, Korean universities or whatever, but they, what they really want to do is go to American Ivy League universities. That's like their dream dream. Uh, another interesting point that's going on right now is the fact that uh, it's currently you know, the off season for school and universities, so typically around this time it's about two there would be like lots of people running around going from university to home and uh, at the moment it's relatively barren there are students here and there but uh, for the most part I think it's, it's a relatively uh, empty streets are at least um, yeah but uh, it's interesting it's very interesting I'm gonna go Right now I'm on the way, I think, to check out one more place, and then I'll head in for a little bit and then head back out to uh, find a couple more places. I figure, I figure if I look at about four, four, four to six places a day, that'll be pretty good. It's kind of weird too, but I'm kind of doing what I'm doing. It's hard to kind of do that effectively. So I have to kind of find times when people are kind of like leaving the, the schools or whatever. So it's like not, not super easy, probably not the most efficient thing to do, but so far it's been, uh, it's been actually pretty good, no complaints. Um, but anyway, I think that's about it for today. Uh, there's not too much else to say. Um, it is a fascinating thing. It is a fascinating thing to be here. It 
is. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll talk with you in a couple days. Bye.